here. This is my invention. <laughs> because I didn't like the way some people, when you do a butt landing, it's not, nobody wants to do a butt landing, but they happen. And what, what you can see what takes, uh, what takes the brunt force is the bottom of this cage, or the, yeah, the cage here. And, and this, this will break off. And then you gotta find somebody to weld that thin metal in it, it's just not cool. So what I did is I got these things right here. They look like wood, but they're actually plastic. They're some kind of a white, I, I don't know. I, I got them when I used to work at a, a boat manufacturing place here many years ago, but it's a plastic. So what happens, I, I screwed you on these rubber, these little rubber feet on the back of there to get it to tilt forward more. So now, now this thing's not as tippy. And now if you look at this real co close, if you land hard, or you land on your butt or land on this thing hard, watch, watch this give. You got some give there, okay? And there is no way that your cage is gonna hit that ground. There's no way. And all the, all the, all the energy, if you hit your butt, all this energy is going to transfer up into this leg of this frame instead of out here you know i think it's an improvement it's not you know it's not a big genius thing but it's lightweight and uh i like it and like i said it's that's not as tippy as it normally would be what about your throttle here throttle that kind of well, i took the throttle apart and i took the carb off and that the, the little nipple as you would call it the swivel had broken off and to buy one online, they were like 10 bucks for this little tiny little brass thing. I was like, heck no. So I tried hooking the, I, geez, I got, here's three cables laying behind me. This is my fourth one. I finally got it right. <laughs> it's, I tried hooking it on top here first because I found out when you, when you go full throttle on the bottom, where it's supposed to be hooked up, you were only opening up the throttle about three quarters of the way. So I didn't want that. So I tried hooking it up here on this, on a little, I don't know, a little throttle arm that was on here because when it, it was just perfect, that would open up the throttle all the way. But that ended up breaking off too. So I took this throttle rod out, drilled a hole in it right where I needed it. So now when I pull the throttle, the throttle opens all the way. And I don't, and all I had to do was make a little, little zigzag underneath here to stick that cable in and it, and it works beautiful with a couple of these um barrel clamps nice and what I'll, about the actual hand throttle itself looks a little modified yeah i ordered that it's just a it's a it's just a brake cable let me get this all undone it's just a brake cable for a bmx bike the, the cable was and the the brake handle and this one's got a lock on it so that way if I want to screw around with something else while I'm in the air it'll lock the throttle open Cruise and control exactly damn this thing did not come with a spring in it like the original so I had a I rigged up a, a spring down here to give me the the spring I needed to uh, retract the oh, yeah. throttle and now yeah. and now it's uh better than it was before it's like holy crap Yes. That's pretty damn nice. That's smooth. That's nice. And um, custom paint job, chicken wire? Two inch. Two inch chicken wire. Oop. Yeah. Solid. Does it run? Does it run? You had to ask. So let's see. Put the choke on. This thing's got a lot of compression. You want to hold that throttle in your hand or? first yep yep nice well you did quite a number on this thing it looks beautiful looking forward to uh giving it a test flight and once again this is john and uh he's gonna be a new pilot he flew once already right yeah twice once once, once. just once 
Definitely one of the most unique looking paramotors out there. Totally custom. You're not going to find one of these anywhere else. The Marine Edition Blackhawk 125. Everybody needs one of these. Of course, this is your disconnect. Bam, look at that. No fuel loss. No. Uh, and with the leather belt. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't, the strap that was on here, I think somebody cut it shorter because it barely reached and, and the Blackhawk symbol was upside down. And I was oh, like, that's my brother. And I was like, man, it looks like everybody else is Blackhawk. So I went with the leather strap. You know, punched a couple of extra holes in it. American pride. Who are you voting for? Who am I voting for? Well, his name's on the front of my barn. This is what I want to show you. Okay, this is the strings that tighten uh, the wire, the wire cage. All right, these you might notice, these come oh, off, yeah. of, these things come off of what were on the uh, on the weight shift arms. Okay, now instead of using all these straps that went around here and around, blah, 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 I just, uh, let's make this easier to see. Okay. Okay, I see this one's gotta go out like this. Okay, see, I put, I got, I, I, I keep stuff, so I keep springs. So here's a spring, and these, these ropes stretch a little bit so I can tighten them up again, which isn't a big deal. So the, the springs hold the tension. Instead of using straps, buckles, knots, whatever you want, now if I wanna, if I wanna tighten it all up, I can just bam, go to the next blink. And there it is, see now, now she's tight again. This one's, this one's still good, but you know, yeah, that one's pretty good. I'm not gonna pull that one off. But um, see, I like that. This this works just sweet. And, you know, and if you and if you wanted to take this off, bam, you know, it, it just comes off just like you gotta stretch that spring. Like that, okay? And then I can take it, unravel it. If I wanted to make a repair, or replace this chicken wire, which I think cost 10 bucks, not 150. And that, and when I first put this on, that, that chicken wire was tight. I mean, I was playing Yankee Doodle on it. It was so tight, it was a string. So anyway, that's, that's another modification that I did. Um, I rewired everything. Everything's been completely rewired with new wiring. Good uh, as it gets. I hope it does me as good as I got it. So when you're in a bad mood, that I, I look at my, my motivation right here. If I'm not feeling it, just send it. Solid.